Queensland's main children's hospital has undergone a controversial name change and it will cost taxpayers about half a million dollars. The Lady Salento name will be removed and the facility rebranded the Queensland Children's Hospital. Here's state political reporter Alison Horn. David Salento is gutted. His mother's name will be stripped from Queensland's main children's hospital. As a family, we're, we're devastated. We are appalled by the whole thing and very angry about it. From today, the Lady Salento will be rebranded as the Queensland Children's Hospital, a decision the minister says was driven and backed up by doctors. This is about putting the brand of Queensland in the centre of a hospital that is Queensland's Children's Hospital. At a local level, uh, it, there was uh, confusion as to whether uh, this hospital was a public or a private facility. The name change will cost about half a million dollars with the largest chunk of taxpayer money to be splashed on new signage. If one extra parent knows that the first place they should take their child if they're sick is the Queensland Children's Hospital, then that will be money well spent. In the context of uh, this hospital's budget, it's a very small amount. Lady Phyllis Salento was a medical pioneer and chosen by the LNP as the name of the hospital in 2014. The opposition has attacked the change as an ego-driven decision. The Palaszczuk government has undergone a political exercise simply because they didn't name the hospital. Uh, it's been a total waste and it will be a total waste of taxpayers' money. The Salento family hasn't had a face-to-face -face meeting with either the Premier or the Health Minister about the name change. They say they only learned of the final decision in a phone call from a personal assistant. The only reason that people have their names ripped off buildings and things like that or the removal of their titles is usually because they're persons of ill repute or, or, uh, or actual criminals. Um, my mother was neither. The government is considering using the Lady Salento name in a hospital wing. Alison Horne, ABC News, Brisbane.